fellow humans. So I have a little bit of disappointing news. So if you watch my last Leave it to Chance video, at the end of that video, I pulled an activity of going to the botanical gardens here in town. Unfortunately, whenever I was writing those activities out, I did not realize how wonky the hours were for the botanical gardens here in town. It turns out that the hours are Tuesdays to Fridays from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. and I work on Monday through Friday and I don't get off until 5. Do you see the issue? So instead of being stuck in limbo waiting for me to be able to create that content, I figured I could just pull a new activity and whenever I have the availability to take off and go to the botanical gardens, we'll put that in the series. But until then, I think it's okay for us to pull another activity. So we're going to give this a nice good shake. We're going to go ahead and pull this new activity out and let's see. Oh, it's upside down. I have recent buy hauls. So like things that I've recently bought. I have bought some things recently. I'm going to a music festival in July so I have bought a couple of pieces for an outfit that I'm going to be piecing together. And I have a few other things as well. And you know what? I actually think I have a couple packages in the mail. So I'm gonna run downstairs and go grab those. I'm gonna run around my apartment really quick and see what else I've bought recently. And then I'll be right back. I got some things. So I'm gonna start off with my supplements and like vitamins that I've recently bought because it's something new in my life and I bought them recently. So they're gonna be added in here. To start off with, I got some vitamin D with vitamin K. I was told the vitamin K helps you actually absorb the vitamin D and I have mental issues. I uh, suffer from depression and I've heard really good things about vitamin D. So I figured why not give it a try. The second ones are omega-3s. And this one actually also has fish oil in it as well, which I figured would help um, like moisturize my skin from the inside out because I went from living in Florida, a very humid area, to Colorado, a very dry area. Well, where I live specifically is very dry here. So got those as well. And last but not least, this is Ray in the Mood. It has a bunch of different supplements mixed in with it and honestly, I'm not even going to try to say most of the names for them. Actually, I'm not gonna to try to say any of the names for them. If you're interested in looking into these, you can. So in the mood, yes, kind of does apply what it's supposed to do. I'm actually mostly trying them out because I saw someone on TikTok talking about it and um, she said that I gave her a lot of energy and I feel like I have a lot of energy issues. So I was like, why not? And if it can, you know, put you in the mood, maybe it's worth it to try it. Here are a few things that I actually bought today. This is a nice little mister <laughs> that I got for my plants from Lowe's. It mists very well. And I don't have to sit there and go psh, 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 psh. like the more you pump it, the like way longer it goes. The other thing is this crystal nail file. I think it's supposed to be like a glass nail file, which like it just works way better than the like regular sandpaper nail files and like the metal ones. I've heard this is going to be a new try item. And the last thing that I bought today was this dry brush. From Eco Tools, I really like Eco Tools. Um, pretty much everything that they create is biodegradable, which I'm trying to become more uh, sustainable in the things that I use every day or my day to day life. So, this is one thing to help exfoliate my skin. So, hopefully, it does a great job because I need that. Because, again, it's really dry here. Another thing that I bought recently is this lip oil. I ordered it from an Etsy shop that is called The Vibe House. I'll leave links down to like the actual shops that you can buy things from on like Etsy that I purchased from down in the description. But this lip oil is infused with crystals if you're like into that spiritual stuff. But 
To be completely honest with you, one of the main reasons why I bought this is not for my lips. It's actually for the inside of my nostrils because my nose gets so dry. It is so painful and I'm not enjoying it. And I got a full package from them, like I think November of last year. This one is actually Gemini. They base their stuff off of Zodiac signs. So my first care package situation was Scorpio, which is my sun sign. Gemini is my rising sign. So I think that's enough about that. Next up on my list of things that I've bought recently is this little like skirt overlay. It's a mesh skirt with silver glitter stars on it and it's just supposed to go over some little bottoms that you get. So the company that I got this from is called Plur Bunny Boutique on Etsy. P-L-U-R-B-U-N-N-Y boutique, all one word. Again, I'll put a link in the description if you're interested in looking into their shop if you have any raves that you're going to because that's why I got this one. Um, this is actually part of like a whole on set but you have to buy the pieces individually and I like exploring and just buying separate things and piecing my outfits together. So that's why I didn't buy the entire set. So I left my packages for last because I feel like opening packages is just a little bit more interesting. But from that skirt kind of leads into this because this is supposed to be the top that I'm going to be wearing with that skirt. So let's open this up. This is not an easy open package like most of them. So Voila. Oh no. It's gold stars. It was supposed to be silver stars. Well, I'll show you anyways. I might have to return this one and get the silver stars because I don't know how I feel about mixing silver and gold. But you know what? I think that the original one that I was looking at was a navy blue with silver stars and this is black with gold stars. I mean, it's cute. I might have to consult the girls and see what they think, but it's a nice little velvety material with cute little stars on it. It has a lace up back, which I liked because that means that I will be able to completely like adjust the tightness of the straps, which is something that tends to bother my body a little bit. So I'll try them on together, not in this video. I think that will be a little too revealing. And plus I need to get bottoms to go under that skirt anyways. But if you like follow me on Instagram, you might be able to see my outfits in July. But yeah, this is like a nice uh, material. Um, I think I don't like the fact that it is printed on both sides. I have pretty sensitive skin. I'm not sure if that will irritate it or not. I'll just have to try it on eventually. Eee, I'm so excited. So both this and this company are companies that I've bought from before. So I like being able to continuously support the small companies that I enjoy buying from. This one is Flutterby Studio. She's actually a Shopify person now instead of Etsy. So what I actually bought from her is supposed to go with my outfit as well. It's just like a nighttime theme rave outfit that I'm trying to make. Let's go ahead and open this up. I'm not good at opening packages, <laughs> but I've done well enough. Ah. She puts lavender in everything. It smells so good. Okay, so I have that. I have a nice little thank you note. I hope you love the earrings, Amber. She's so sweet. I, I actually found her on TikTok too, and I just enjoy all of the stuff that she does. Oh, I'm a giveaway winner. So I'll leave this for a moment. This is the earrings that I got. So cute little butterfly sticker. And let me open this up. Yeah, I'm so excited. So she puts everything in these cute little bags. You can reuse them for other things. 
Oh my god, she puts dry lavender in them and it smells so good. I love the smell of lavender. They're so cute! Here are the earrings. They are moons with little moonstone crystals. They're so freaking cute. Oh my god. I am obsessed. I am obsessed with crystals that have flash in them. Labradorite is my absolute favorite crystal of all time. But yeah, I just love, love, love crystals that have flash in them. I am the giveaway winner because I was actually her first order on her new Shopify account. So let's open this up. Super protected. I appreciate that. And I think this crystal is actually something that I really don't know much about. So I'm excited to add something new to my collection. Here it is. Look at this freaking beauty. Oh my goodness. Look at the little peaks of dark green. I love it. I just love crystals. I just love crystals. And if you can't tell, it's in the shape of a heart. Super cute. And she gave me another little freebie. A little thank you freebie. So then this as well. Hmm. It's probably a quartz of some sort. I'm actually not entirely sure, but I believe this might be one that she actually sourced herself. She lives in Georgia, so I might have to ask her what it is, but I'll make a list underneath her link to her shop of all of the little crystals that she got me. But yeah, so that's all of my recent buy hauls right now. Hey, so it's the next day and I was editing my video and then I realized that I forgot to do something. And that something is pulling a new activity. I'm assuming I forgot because I did it at the beginning of the video, but I'm supposed to pull a new activity at the end. So let's give this another nice, good shake. Hopefully it's a good one. Okay. What's it gonna be? Okay, so the next video will be a mental health talk. That's kind of intimidating and I guess I need to do a little bit of research on like terms and such so that I can like properly talk about it. Okay, so with that being said, I'll catch you on the flip side and we're gonna get back to the outro that I recorded yesterday. I hope that you enjoyed it even a little bit. If you did, please don't forget to hit the like button. If you want to see my face more often, you can hit the subscribe button. But either way, I hope that you have a wonder miss whatever time of day it is, and I'll see you next time. Bye!